Asante, asante. Tuwapigia hawa makovi mazuri. Uh, kwa sababu tunaingia katika chaching, nitomba muwape wa toto, ama mtoto, I mean, uh, na vasi enyu inakuja. Asante. Na before tuendele, nitomba wapewe Mike, wawese kusalimia kanisa. Uh, kanisa tuko hapa siku ya leo kwa hanchili ya familia ya Patrick Hili kuchunga na wao katika hali ya kumshukuru mungu Kwa hanchili ya mbaraka sa mtoto Na tena kumshukuru mungu kwa hanchili ya mama kuchifungua fiema Kwa hivyo ina tupasa tukawese kuchunga pamoja na familia hii Hili tukawese kumshukuru mungu Na tukawese pia uh, kumshukuru mungu kwa hanchili ya sawandi ya mtoto Kwa hivyo, uh, nitomba ya kwamba tushikiane pamoja katika uh, ipanda hii uh, ya chaching na pia katika ipanda ya upatiso. Kwa na iso asivuwe sana. Because the Lord our God is good, we all of us say we shall praise him with the Psalms. Tomba kanisa tuseme we shall praise him with the Psalms. Give thanks to the Lord for he is good, we all of us say his love is you us forever. Unless the Lord builds a house, it builds us deeper in vain. Unless the Lord watches over a city, the watchman is study gun in vain. In vain, you rise up hurry and stay up late, toiling uh, food to eat. To those he loves, he grant them sleep. Sons are a heritage from the Lord. Children are a reward from the Lord. Like arrows in the hands of a warrior, are a sons born in one's youth. Blessed is the man whose quiver is full of them. They will not be put to shame when they contend with their enemies in the gate. These Psalms are written by David, reminds us that children are a blessing, are a gift, a reward from the Lord. And therefore, Patrick uh, and your wife, it is a reminder that today, uh, the child that God gave you, it is a reward uh, that God chose and he, he saw that it is good to reward you in your life. Therefore, uh, the Bible says that this son is your strength. And uh, this child that God has given you, uh, he is uh, your strength. And therefore, uh, you are required to raise uh, the child in the likeness that God uh, requires. Na katika jinsi ambafyo mungu anakusundia hili mukawese kumulea mtoto huyu katika uh, hili ya kasindi kukua nchisi ambavyo alikuwa uh, Yesu Kristu katika kimo na katika hekima na mungu wa kimpenda na kipendwa na watu wote maandiko metombia kwamba watoto katika humli mchanga ni kama amishare uh, in the hands of a warrior ama katika mikono mwa muindanchi na kwa hivyo uh, mjue ya kwamba at uh, this time that God chose to bless you with a child, uh, Mungu alione ya kwamba katika ujana wenu, uh, Mungu akawese kuwa sawandi, na hili mkao sindi kushundia wema wa Mungu, na vadhiri sa Mungu, 
katika maisha yenu kwa nisi wasivue sana and uh, it is by the grace of god not because of any good action not because of how uh, you know it but it is because of the goodness of god praise be to god kwa nisi wasivue sana kwa hivyo nitomba mpiga magoti uh, utapea mtoto mike atarudia nyuma yangu pia utamsaidia utarudia nyuma yangu i love the lord i love the lord for the i love the lord i love the lord for the for he heard my voice for he heard my voice he heard my cry for mercy he heard my cry for mercy because he turned his ear to me because he turned his ear to me i will call on him as long as i live i will call unto him as long as i live the cons of death entangled me the cause of death and tongue. the anguish of the grave came upon me the anguish of the grave came up upon me upon me i was overcome by trouble and sorrow i was overcome by trouble and sorrow then i called on the name of the lord then i called on the name of the lord o lord save me o lord save me the lord is gracious and delicious the lord is gracious and righteous our god is full of compassion our god is full of compassion the lord protects the simple hearted the lord protects its, its the, the simple hearted the lord when i was in great need when i was in great need he saved me he saved me be at rest once more o my soul be at, at rest be at rest once more be at rest once more oh my soul oh my soul for the lord has been good to you for the lord has been good to you for you oh lord have delivered my soul for you oh lord have delivered my soul from from death from death my eyes from tears my eyes from tears my feet from stumbling my feet from stumbling that i may walk before the lord that i may walk before the lord in the land of the living in the land of the living i believed therefore i said i believe therefore i say i'm greatly afflicted i'm greatly afflicted in my dismay i said in my dismay in my dismay i said o men are liars o men are liars how can i repay the loan how can i repay the lord for all his goodness to me for all his goodness to me i will lift up the cup of salvation i will lift up the cup of salvation and call upon the name of the lord and call upon the name of the lord i will fulfill my vows i will fulfill my vows to the lord to the lord in the presence of all his people in the presence of all his people i will sacrifice I will sacrifice a thank offering to you a, a, a thank offering to you a thank offering to you and call on the name of the Lord and call on the name of the Lord I will fulfill my vows to the Lord I will fulfill my vows to the Lord in the presence of all his people in the presence of all his people in the courts of the house of the Lord in the courts of the house of the Lord in your midst O Jerusalem in your midst o jerusalem praise the lord praise the lord in the name of god the father the son and the holy spirit amen, amen. you and christ nita warika you dedicate this child Natazama pale Yerusalemu palikuwa na mtu jina lake Simoni na yeye ni mtu mwenye haki mcha Mungu akitarajia baranja ya Israeli na Roho Mtakatifu alikuwa juu yake na yeye alikuwa ameonywa na Roho Mtakatifu ya kwamba hataona 
mauti kabla ya kumuona Kristo wa Bwana baadhi akanja ekaruni baadhi akanja ekaruni amuongozwayo na roho na wale wazazi wali, walipomleta mtoto Yesu ndani ili wamfanyie kama iliyokuwa desturi ya sheria yeye mwenyewe alipompokea mkononi mwake yeye mwenyewe alipompokea mkononi mwake akamshukuru Mungu akasema Bazi poana mruhuzu mtumizi wako kwa amani kama ulivyosema kwa kuwa macho yangu yameona wokofu wako uliomwekea tayari machoni ma watu, pa watu wako nuru ya kuwa mwangaza wa watakatifu na wakuwa utukuvu wa watu wako Israeli Amen, amen. Itomba msimame. Itomba msimame. Njia kuomba uh, katika safari na katika kuomba Mungu, Mungu alisikia maombi yenu. Bwana Yesu asivue sana. Na jinsi ambavyo maandiko imetujulisha siku ya leo kwamba mtoto ni sawandi kutoka kwa Mungu, it's a reward. And uh, siku ya leo mtatangaza ya kwamba mtamshukuru Mungu wenu uh, mahari pa watu na pia mtatimisia Mungu nadhili katika maisha yenu. Bwana Yesu asivue sana. Kwa hivyo nitaomba huu ni wakati wenu wa kushukuru Mungu kwa hanchi ya baraka ya mtoto na tena kwa hanchi ya uh, Mungu kuwawezesha na pia for the save the refari of the child. Praise be to God. Si jambo la kawaida tunajia kwamba it is a matter of life and death but we are thankful to God ya kwamba Mungu akaweza kuwakomboa katika hali mbaya and therefore that the reason we are here to celebrate with you uh, the blessings of God kanisa wasivue sana praise be to God uh, kwa hivyo kanisa nasi tulikuwa tumealikwa ili tuje tukasherekee na tukafurahie na tukashuhudie baraka za Mungu katika maisha yao kwa hivyo naomba sote tukaweze kusimama sote tukaweze kusimama ili tuweze Uh, kujunga na wao katika kushukuru Mungu kwa ajili ya baraka na tena tukisindi kuombea wasasi hawa ya kwamba Mungu atawapa chochote kinachohitajika katika kumlea mtoto huyu na tena mtoto atakuwa katika njia ambazo zinastahili. Okay. Ya nitomba tupe wimbo as tunakuja kujunga na wao katika kushukuru Mungu. Mambo sawa sawa Mambo sawa sawa Yesu akiwa nzini Mambo sawa sawa Mambo sawa sawa Mambo sawa sawa Imba mambo Mambo sawa sawa Mambo sawa sawa Mambo sawa sawa Yesu Yesu akiwa nzini mambo sawa sawa mambo sawa sawa mambo sawa sawa mambo mambo sawa sawa mambo sawa sawa Yesu akiwa nzini mambo sawa sawa mambo sawa sawa mambo sawa sawa mambo Praise the Lord. Blessings and honor we give unto you. We sing my praise, oh Lord. We sing my praise, oh Lord. Hallelujah. We sing my praise, oh Lord. Blessings and honor we give unto you. We sing my praise, oh Lord. Alpha, Omega, you are worthy for my praises today. Alpha Omega you are worthy of my, my praises today Alpha Omega Alpha Omega you are worthy of my, my praises today Alpha Omega Alpha Omega you are worthy of my praises today 
Receive my praise, O oh Lord. Hallelujah. Receive my praise, O oh Lord. Blessings and honor. Blessings and honor we give unto you. Receive my praise, O oh Lord. Receive my praise, O oh Lord. Hallelujah. Receive my praise, O oh Lord. Blessings and honor we give unto you. Receive my praise, O Lord. Makobi Mazuri Yesu. Hey, hey. Yeah. Ime muona bwana, ime muona bwana, ime muona bwana, ana pendeza. Ime muona bwana, ime muona bwana, ime muona bwana, ana pendeza. Ime muona bwana, ime muona bwana, ime muona bwana. Asante, asante. Nitomba wasasi mpige magoti as we make this prayer. Ni asante mungu wetu mema, tunakushukuru na kulinua jina lako kwa hanchi mungu wetu ya familia yake Patrick ambao siku yale ya mungu wetu wamekunja kutukusa na kushukuru mfani mwafalme kwa hanchi ya kusawandia na mtoto bwana na tena Mungu wetu wanapomleta katika madhapao mfalme wa falme na tena Bwana tunapomrejesha mama katika ushirika wa madhapao haya tomba Mungu wetu kwa sandaka hii ambayo imetolewa Bwana tukomba mfalme wa falme ukamkubalishe mama kuendelea katika kasi ya madhapao haya na katika sakramenti sote ambazo Mungu wetu tunaamini katika kanisa hili ili Mungu wetu siku sote anapokuwa pundu mahali hapa na anapo Mungu wetu kutorea sandaka sake mahali hapa na familia yake Mungu wetu baba ukasindi kuwa pariki na kuainua na tena Bwana kwa sandaka hii si Mungu wetu kawape neema ya kumlea mtoto katika kandri ya uwezo wako mfano wa falme ili papa katika mahitaji ya mtoto akawese kuyapata na tena Bwana tukiomba Mungu wetu kwa sandaka hisi mtoto ukamfanye akakuwa jinsi mwanao Yesu Kristo alivyokuwa Mungu wetu katika kimo Mungu wetu akipata hekima na tena papa ukimpenda na akipendwa na watu wote hivyo ndivyo tomba siku ya leo Mungu wetu ya kwamba atakuwa mtoto wa baraka kupitia sandaka hisi na kwamba Mungu wetu siku sote watasindi kuinua na kulisivu jina lako kwa hanchi Mungu wetu ya kuonekania na kuwatenda mema na ni katika nchini Mungu papa Mungu mwana na Mungu roho mtakatifu tumeomba amen 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 tomba tuendelee na wimbo wakati sasa wasimamisi wanapokuja lakini wanapoendelea kuja ni tomba you and grace uweze sasa kuwapariki kwa mafuta matakatifu tuendelee na wimbo amen mambo sawa sawa mambo sawa sawa Yesu akiwa enzini mambo sawa sawa mambo sawa sawa mambo yote sawa mambo sawa mambo sawa sawa mambo sawa sawa Yesu akiwa enzini mambo sawa sawa mambo sawa sawa mambo sawa sawa sitaogopa Mambo sawa mambo sawa mambo sawa mambo sawa sawa mambo sawa sawa Yesu mambo sawa sawa mambo sawa sawa mambo sawa sawa Asante uh, tukiwa katika hiyo hali je mchungaji mtoto hiyo amepatiswa Wapendwa kama mnavyofahamu watu wote walisaliwa katika dhambi na Yesu Kristo alisema mimi ndimi njia na hakuna atakayefika kwa papa asipopita kwangu pia alisema anayetaka kuingia katika ufalme wa Mungu sharti asaliwe kwa mara ya pili kwa Roho Mtakatifu yafaa tumsi Mungu papa wetu ili amuondore mtoto huyu dhambi kwa njia upatiso huu wa manchi na Roho Mtakatifu Hamfanye kuwa mfuasi wa kanisa lake daima na ha, awe chombo savi na kwa hivyo nitomba mpige magoti ili tuweze kuomba Mungu mwenye nguvu na rehema nyingi 
uliokoa nu na usao wake katika Savina ukaokoa wana wa Israeli wakafuka mbahali ya Shamu ishale ya upatiso wa maji matakatifu mwanao Yesu Kristo ali patiswa na Yohana katika mto wa Yordani wewe uliyemsushia roho mtakatifu kama njiwa alipotoka kwenye manchi twakusi umpe mtoto huyu msamaa wa dhambi kwa njia ya upatiso umfanye hukufuata daima tangu sasa akupende akuheshimu na akutumainie maisha atumainie maisha ya mbinguni siku sote katika njia ya Mungu Papa Mungu Mwana na Mungu Roho Mtakatifu Ah, nitomba sasa tukawese kusomewa habari jema katika kitabu ya mtakatifu Mariko sura ya kumi haya ya kumi na tatu wakamletea watoto wa ndogo ili awaguze wanavunzi wake wakawakemea bazi akawaletea watoto wa ndogo ili waguze na wanavunzi wake akawakemea aka yeyote atakayekubali ufalme wa Mungu kama mtoto mdogo ha, hata uingia kabisa akawakumbatia akawawekea mikono yake eh, akawakumbatia akawawekea mikono yake juu yao akawabali Uh, tutaendelea hili tukawese sasa kusikia kutoka kwa wasimamisi kwa mtoto huyu kana kwamba wako tayari kuchukua majukumu ambayo wakati ambapo uh, Patrick pamoja na mke wake walipo waendea na wakawaomba wawese kuwa wasasi wa kiroho wa mtoto huyu kana kwamba wako tayari wanisi wasivue sana je ni nyinyi mmewaleta mtoto huyu ili apatiswe tena mmemuomba Yesu hili ya kupali kuwapaliki kuwasamehe dhambi zenu kuwapa roho mtakatifu na ufalme wa mbinguni mesikia kuwa yeye utimisa handi sake sote alisohindi watu wake kama wadhamini wa mtoto huyu naomba mniambie mambo haya kwa fini wa uh, vienu ya kwamba kwa niapa ya mtoto huyu wakati ambapo atafikia humri unaostahili mtamwambia viapo ambavyo mtahapa siku ya leo sijui kama mko tayari ya kwamba wakati ataitimu umri wa kuelewa mambo mtamweleza viapo ambavyo siku ya leo amnaenda kuapa je mtamkataa shetani na kazi zake sote rasi siso na maana mambo ya kidunia mawaso maovu ya kimwili na mongoso na mongoso uh, wa dunia semeni ndio nime tumeyakataa yote na je mnataka mtoto huyu apatiswe katika imani gani unajua ukiri wa imani nataka sasa utuambie hiyo imani ili wakati mtoto atafikia umri unaostahili mtamwambia hiyo imani aliyopatiswa katika hiyo imani mtaomba wapewe mic hata kama ni ile lugha mnafahamu saindi Sura sima ikue Kiswahili ama Kiingereza. Sawa sawa. Mungu sikitie ngaiza bwana nyaonze, muombi wa igoro nanze, na ngete kila Yesu Kristo muro wako wa mama mwadhani wetu. Basi ari roni mwili wetu eta kwa Mariamu, wagera hiyo ndo aro mudheru. Akinya ridende aponto pirato, akiamba mutse igoro, agekua, agekua, agekuruka kwa ngoma. Mudhenya wa gatatu akiriuka kiuma kure yako ake hai sai guru na ri wai karete guko ini koro ko anga ide muni nya wonde me ako ima ko a o ke guko asiri de ara mari mo na ara makwite na ningere te fikite ro mudheru na guko kanida mudheru wa nde yothe na guko igwa no ando ara ya theru na guko ko ero ko amehia na guko kuriuka ko amwire na guko moyota ga zira amen suri bana jiwa imani ya kanisa ni murenda mwanoyo abatidwe thini wa bitikiosio 
Uga yugo ni gotu kuenda. Yugo ni gotu kuenda. Asanti. Ani tomba kanisa tusimame. Tomba kanisa tusimame. Wa mwendea Yesu kwa kusafiwa na kuoshwa kwa damu ya kondoo yeah, yeah, jene ma yake atumwagia na kuoshwa kwa damu wa mwendea Yesu kwa kusafiwa tutaendelea Mungu mwenye enzi uishie milele mwanao Yesu Kristo alidhirisha umuhimu wa upatiso kwa kupatiswa na Yohana katika mtu wa Yerodani Roho mtakatifu akashuka juu yake kama jiwa alitokwa ndamu pafuni mwake pale msarapani kwa hanchi ya utakaso wetu utume wake mkuu kwa wanafunzi ni kuenenda katika mataifa yote na kuwapatisa walio tupu katika njini la papa, mwana na roo mtakatifu. Tokuomba uyapariki haya manchi, yawe matakatifu ndaima. Hili mtoto huyu anapo patiso na kwa manchi haya, ashiriki kufa na kufuka pamoja na krisu. Uwafany, umfanye kungara kama theruji, andamu wakali apate kusiko hapa, na andamu wa sasa aonekane upia. Very good. Liam Mudomi, akubatiza sasa katika jina la mungu baba, mungu mwana, na mungu rom takatifu. Kwa mwendea, yesu kwa kusafiwa, na kuoshwa kwa damu ya kondo. Asante, asante. Kwa sasa nitaomba Young Grace 
tuweze kuombea mtoto huyu na kumbariki na mafuta. Baba katika jina la Yesu Kristo Mungu wetu mwema onyesha mfano mwema wa ubatizo mtakatifu. Baba mbinguni ndipo tumefanya mtoto huyu mudhomi. Mwenyezi Mungu Baba awe mmoja wetu na hawe mshiriki pamoja nasi. Baba wetu mbinguni tumekukubalia na tumemleta mbele yako. Mbariki tembea naye. Mfanye yote mazuri kama vile Yesu alikuwa Mwenyezi Mungu akapendwa nawe na ukapendwa na watu mtoto huyu mudhomi naye Mwenyezi Mungu tunamkabidhi kwake katika jina la Mungu ya tuwapikie makovi mazuri wamechukua kazi sao uh, nitomba kanisa tuwese kuketi evangelist uja sasa mwamba mwenye himala kwa koni tanjivicha majia yonadamu ya liyo wasiviwe uh, pia siku ya leo walikuwa wamekata kauri ya kwamba watamaliza kila kitu siku moja kwa nisi wasiviwe sana kwa hivyo sasa uh, tumemaliza mambo ya upatiso wanataka kumleta kwa madhapao kwa nisi wasiviwe sana praise be to god kwa hivyo pia tunawapa nafasi hii na nitamuomba askofu mkuu aweze kufanya hiyo sacrament ya kurindim uh, mtoto huyu lao na Mwenyezi Mungu. Ah uh, nitaomba mzungacha tusomee ah uh, Nehemiah 10 kuanzia mstari wa 35. Because those, there are the things that they uh, walikubaliana. Wakasema haya ni mambo ambayo tutayafanya ili uhusiano wetu na Mungu uendelee kundumu. Na mambo mengine walikuwa wamesahau wame jua aliwafanya hata wao mateka katika nchi ya Babylonia na kule kwingine kwa sababu Mungu eh uh, ukikubaliana tafanya jambo fulani ile ni asma uende ufanye usifo ufanye basi uhusiano au kwa msuri tena kwa hivyo ni mengi ambao waliongea pale lakini ningetaka tuende chini mstari wa 35 mpaka 39 Nehemiah 10 Nehemiah 10 kuanzia mstari wa 35 tunaindi kuleta kila mwaka malimbuko yetu ya masao na ya matunda ya kila mti kwenye nyumba ya Mwenyezi Mungu kwanza kwa masao masao yote ya kwanza kama ni matunda kama ni masao ya aina yote ya kwanza kabisa kabla hujapeleka kwako kwa nyumbani waende kuyakula ama upeleke katika gara sawa la kwanza unapeleka wapi kanisani tunafanya hivyo jamani ama tulisahau kama kama wao Israeli hawa wakasema tena uh, 36 Kwa kufuata ilivyo andiku wakatika sheria, kila msaliwa wa kwanza wa kiume, kila msaliwa wa kwanza, katika nyumba setu, uh-huh. atapereku katika nyumba ya mungu wetu, kwa kuhani, wanao undumu humo, pia tutapereka kila mtu. Kwanza, kwanza, kwanza. Awapereku katika ekaru, kwa kuhani, wanao undumu huko, awe moya wao. Huyo mtoto huyo mtoto wa kwanza. Eh hey, si si wenu wa wasasi. Mtamlea akifika mahali kama hapo sasa mdhomi wako na wale umpeleke sasa akae huko. Aru. Praise God. 
Eh, hey, wa kwanza. Basi na wakaendelea kuongea mengine mengi. Wanaweza kusoma umalize. That seven uh, kila unga wetu wa kwanza matoreo yetu Ehe. matunda ya miti yeah. ndifai na mafuta tutavileta kwa kohani kwenye fiumba vya nyumba ya Mungu wetu Aha. tena tutareta saka setu za masao yetu kwa warawi kwani ndio wanao usika na ukusanyanchi wa saka hizo katika vijiji vyetu kuhani msawa wa aruni atakuwa na warawi wanapopokea saka alafu warawi watapokea sehemu ya kumi ya saka sote sehemu ya kumi vile vile ya saka sote sehemu ya kumi ya masao sehemu ya kumi ya vyote na mzaliwa wa kwanza na masao ya kwanza yote yanapelekwa katika hekaru kwa kule kuna kama kuani ndio sasa kazi ya Mungu iendelee wakaendelea Napo mwisho wanataka kusema nini mwisho kabisa? Arafu warawi watapeleka sehemu ya kumi ya saka sote zilizotorewa katika nyumba ya Mungu kwenye fiumba na gara. Watu wa Israeli na warawi watayapeleka matoreo ya nafaka, difai na mafuta ya saituni kwenye fiumba ambamo fiumbo vya patakativu vinatunzwa na ambamo makuhani wa ngoncha marango na waimbanchi wana fiumba vyao na ndaima tuta ndaima tutaijali nyumba ya Mungu wetu ndaima atutasahau tutajali nyumba ya Mungu wetu kwa, kwa mambo yote hayo sasa matoleo yote hayo na mambo ambayo yote waliagana ni kusema kwamba atutasahau nyumba ama hekaru la Bwana wetu so it reminds us that we have obligations ambao tunahitajika kuyafanya. Sasa e, mtoto ni wetu. Ah, uh, Yesu asiviwe. Uh, when we read the book of Exodus chapter 13 verse 1 and 2 uh, mandiko ina tuambia kuhusu consecrating the firstborn uh, uleta watoto ama wasaliwa wa kwanza katika madhapau na hii tukawapeane kwa bwana na sasa Patrick umepeana mtoto kwa bwana na sijui mnataka akae kwa madhapau kama vile uh, Samuel alifanywa ya kwamba aliperekwa na wasasi wake that is Eri and uh, Hana na waka mpeana kwa Bwana na wakatimisa nadhiri sao ama handi sawa kwa Bwana sijui leo mlikuwa mnataka akae huku ama mnataka kumkomboa buying back na ili sasa atoke kwa madhapau arundi uh, kwenu sasa mnataka kumkomboa uh, kwa hivyo hii ni nafasi yenu amkawese sasa uh, kumkomboa msaliwa wa kwanza na ili akarundi katika mikono yenu na mkaendelee kumrea na tena kuhakisha ya kwamba anakuwa jinsi ambavyo Yesu alikuwa uh, wakati anapoendelea na maisha yake kwa hivyo nitaomba mtoe sandaka ya kumkomboa maandiko inasema ya kwamba sandaka itatorewa like exchange now you exchanging uh, this offering you are giving it to God and God Amen. is giving you back the child Amen. Uh, Amen. Uh, Amen. Uh, Amen. Amen. sasa kupokea mtoto kwa sababu umepea Mungu sandaka si ndio Asante kwa hivyo nitakuomba you are grace uh, sandaka hii ambayo imetorewa kama mtoto na wasasi hawa nitaomba mpige magoti Mpige magoti tuombe Hala mtoto alikuwa ameanza kufurahia kukaa hapo. Atuombe. Baba katika jina Yesu Kristu wameto wa mbinguni. Baba sandaka ya kukomboa mtoto wa kwanza wa familia hii Mwenyezi Mungu baba tunaipokea. Tunaomba kwamba baraka nyingi zifuate mtoto huyu na na wasasi wake. Ili Mwenyezi Mungu baba kama vile Yesu mwenyewe alivyoelewa kwa njia inayofaa 
Baba wa mbinguni aenda akafanya hivyo na mtoto hayo mkamilifu katika uzo wako. Nenda sasa kumbariki mudhomi na wasasi. Mwenyezi Mungu Baba kwa sababu wamefanya kulingana na maagizo yako. Nasi tumepokea na kuomba baraka kwao katika jina la Mungu Baba, Mungu Mwana na Mungu Roho Mtakatifu. Amen. Amen. Anani aturaga atali na mwana Agadhine kagione mwiduwe penina Kundusi ya wetu alaga eka ina mahoya Haka hoya ganga ya mweo kete haka mwira Tigwa uweka na papa uweka hii Kenya gatole nyumba ya kufafa Rakini hawa wamechukua tena Tuwapigia makovi mazuri Siju pati kuna nchambo la kusema Ama msaindisi wako Tombo ape maik Dress the archbishop The priest and the evangelist Mawashirika wote ni amjambo. Atijambo. Praise God. Amen. Mwatha ni agoswa. Amen. Mwatha ni agoswa. Amen. Gaine muwega. Na vendesi onde. Gaine muwega. Ena ake mundo. Mbomu andu matesa wakagia na vinya. Praise God. Amen. I'm Matthews Moravi Mugo. Thank you, the clergy. His grace, the bishop. Mwe shukuru sana for accepting uh, to receive our thanksgiving as a family. May you be blessed and alone. 27th, uh, 14th of uh, February 2007 14th of February 2007 he was the Bishop of Embu na wakati ndiyo nilipeleko kwa matau for confirmation. Na ya ndi aligi kwa hiyo uh, the view and uh, I promise that uh, when the time for DM comes I'll still do the same through the grace of God Amen. thank you so much to the congregation uh, you and so many other things to do but uh, you chose to be here to receive to be blessed with us may you be blessed so much and my final thanksgiving is to the uh, Almighty God for this day. Sinja mbola kawainda, kubariki mtoto. Pia sisi tumabarikiwa na mtoto. Na tunashukuru mungu. We know the journey, but through the grace of God, I believe mungu ataendera kusimama na kina Patrick, na atawalinda. Praise God. Najua some of you wanaeza kosa kunikumbuka. But uh, 2007, uh, 2017, nilikuwa huku, wakati nilikuwa na haso. Ni huku ni? Morris. Unakumbuka mali tulikuwa tunalara na pale? Akubisho puwa kati ya unge nijua nilikuwa mkonde sana. <laughs> Aaron was my employee, nilikuwa nafanya kazi yapa car wash for some time of, for a period, tukua na gitonga and some others. But so far nimeona mkono wa mungu umenilinda and I, so far I can testify praise God Amen. praise God Amen. do not die hard <laughs> one time one time whatever that you do in the church of the Lord one day God will pray, repay you praise Jesus Amen. right now ni kombingwa sako I'm the city manager there Nafanya kazi uko kirogoya. And I thank God. Nilimaliza probation last month. I was, uh, I'm yet to be confirmed. And I believe 
through the grace of God I will be praise Jesus alichukua nafasi ile course nilifanya back in 2012 siku anajua hata mtu mmoja apart from my colleagues wenye walifanya hiyo course but he took chance na akafanya the exact same course praise Jesus sasa nashangaa <laughs> si kuna kitu tunareleta hapo but uh, all the same we thank god praise jesus may you be blessed a lot huwa naongea sana <laughs> but may god do you good be blessed amen amen na tukimaliza wageni tusiende haraka uh, especially wazazi wa patrick na mama diam tutakutana kidogo uh, kwanza tuongee kidogo sawa sawa mm-hmm. be blessed amen Uh, nitaomba Matthew Taomba Matthew kuji hapa mbele pamoja na pipi yako uh, when events confirm nobody can disconfirm Panis wasivue sana nataka Yohan Chris kwa heshima kubwa uweze kuombea familia hii ya kwamba kwa ile profession wamekuwa that now God to confirm na wakue uh, wameajiriwa rasmi katika ile kasi wanafanya Panis wasivue sana Amen. Praise God. Amen. Ah, uh, thank you young man and your wife. Ah, uh, takakumbuka kwamba nikuwekea mikono huko Hebu Dauces. Ah, uh, it is good to remember. Ah, uh, and that you also came around here. Ah, uh, as a very young man ukafanya kazi kidogo kidogo. That's why we say that uh, uh, kile Mungu ambaye amekupangia kwani kitakuja. Ah, uh, patient is very important. Na ni vizuri hao wengine waone wajue hivyo, waone hivyo tafadhali practically it happens thank you na mungu aendelee kuwabariki sana mungu ni mwema eh kuja mtoto akuje kama kwa karibu mtoto aletwe Okay, sasa tuombe. Ah, very good. Asante sana. Kwenye magoti. Baba katika jina Yesu Kristo Mungu wetu mwema, naleta familia hii mbele yako. Baba wetu wa mbinguni, kushuhuda ni kwamba umewatoa mbali, umewafanyia mazuri. Na ndipo Mwenyezi Mungu Baba wana testify kwamba wewe ni baba wa imani, ni baba ambaye una promise na unafanya. Naomba Mwenyezi Mungu Baba uendelee kuwabariki, uendelee kutembea na wao ndio kubarikia kazi zao. Mipango yao yote Mwenyezi Mungu Baba iende vile wewe mwenyewe umewapangia. Jua Mwenyezi Mungu Baba matumaini yao ni kwamba wafanye vizuri, kwamba kazi yao iendelee, nyumba yao isimame. Nasi Mwenyezi Mungu Baba tunawakabidhi kwako uende ukafanyie hayo. I commit them before you. May you Lord continue working with them, bond them and bless them. Let them see your goodness in their life. For in Jesus name we pray. Ya, yeah, nitomba sasa the church choir wakuya na kuja hapa mbele. Church choir. We have their time. Kwa dakika chache, I love to ese kuendelea na ipanda. Ya, yeah, nitomba hawa tuwapigie makofi wanapochukua fiti sao.